And we're back. Jade Empire trying to make our way. Oh, that thing just homed in on me. Trying to make our way to whatever wind map this guy found about Lord Lyle's furnace. Oh, this is very strange. We're on the trail of something nasty. Don't. Ugh. Gave me an upgrade off the screen where I couldn't get it. Lord Lyle better appreciate this. I will want a celestial wrench for my trouble. Oh my god. Well, we're definitely losing this time. Oh, so close. But we have to get out of here. We need to try again. I'm going to have to like go full Nintendo and just remember the pattern these things follow. If they even have a pattern. If they're not like random. So they do a real good job of turning right into me when I don't know which way they're going to go. This is very strange. We're on the trail of something nasty. Lord Lau better appreciate this. I don't want a celestial wrench for my trouble. Okay, these ones seem to leave a space in the middle, I think. What manner of beast are we following? I am a little... But then that thing comes in and gets you. Like, I'm sort of figuring out the patterns some of them follow. one of the star points and now it's going faster. It's just too fast for me to keep up with. Yet. I have to go inside and keep on going more time. Oh god, I got one hit left. Okay, are we almost there yet? Oh my god, I did it with no health left. Well, that was right on the edge. Oh boy. Let's see where Lord Lyle's got us headed. My guess was we're going to just appear back at camp with a item or whatnot, rather than having a whole actual new place. That's my guess, anyway. That's what happened with all the other wind maps. All the other wind maps Kang gave us. Yep. Consume spirit. Well, I'm not sure where we crossed from the living world to the celestial, but we seem to have made it back in one piece, and with startling revelations too. Yes, we need to discuss what, um, what was discovered. What was discovered? Did we succeed? I did not see Lord Lau appear. Yes, well, it seems the entity holding the memories of Lord Lau is vanquished. 
the great artificer was imprisoned for insulting heavenly works. Unjustly, I might add. He is free. He is well, somewhat disoriented by the process. Oh, and there is perhaps something else you to be aware of. Um, he is me. A turno is not expecting. Huh. <laughs> so I did all this to rescue a fuel a fool I already had. It was not so much that the body of Lord Lau was imprisoned, for indeed he would have no body, it was his memories, my memories, that were confined within the void. I didn't remember much before a few decades ago, or a century. Hmm, I guess I'm rather old. I still don't remember what I did to earn this fate. I must have stepped a little above myself and angered the celestial bureaucracy. In the time before their wrath filtered down, I built the furnace to point back to myself. So, what now? Will whoever come back for you? I don't think I'll give them cause. I like it here. So many things to build for so many small problems. All the interesting big-scale things are already built. And I have an interest in seeing your endeavor through to the end. For curiosity, you understand. And I could possibly improve the yield of the furnace. I brought two unspoiled gems from our flight to rescue, um, me in the void. The Eyes of the Void. Or the glare of the jerk that locked me up or something. Very volatile fuel. With my new understanding of the furnace, you now have a configuration unrivaled. But there is risk. Combined with this fuel, it may damage the furnace. So, continue using the furnace as it is, or risk its functions on the most powerful effect it can produce. Hmm. Well, if I built it, and I guess I did, I'd fix that restriction first. Do you know any other configurations? You have found quite a number already. I don't know that there are many more to find. Let's get back to my other questions. If you like, but nothing was ever built by talking about it. Let's talk about the furnace. Yes, I'd like another look. I don't know why I thought Lord Lau was overrated. Clearly he, and by he I mean I, understands more than I, and by I I mean me, could know. Or something to that effect. I have a bit of a headache. All right, let's go back to the furnace. Certainly. It's just a flick of a switch. And I'm reasonably sure the trip isn't even doing any irreparable harm. Ah, so Eyes of the Void and two, two more configurations. Although I said they're dangerous. I bet we have to pick one. I'm going to do that one regular one I have first, and then I'll do one of the super ones. Assuming it'll let me do that. Now that we're here, do you have anything else to say? All right. All right. Guess not. Because he said we could continue using it as is. All right, the cow thing. Tiger, all but the cogs. Tiger button, tiger button. Uh, 
the configuration already used, you can't do it twice. All right. Heaven's Blessing Gem, Damage Shield. Open Palm, well, that doesn't do me any good. Yeah, I've already seen all those gems. Did I get any new styles? Oh, I've got Tang's Vengeance. I forgot I got that. But I've already got my favorite weapon style I'm using. Hidden Fist I don't want. Okay, so... The Quieted Mine. Got, got 30 plus focus out of that. That was one of the things I... Seriously... Seriously? I'm gonna just not have a muffler at all. I uh, bought that. I think I bought that. Body plus five, mind plus five. Magical day. Yeah, so you get boosts from the various things you build here. Okay. We already knew that. Eyes of the Void. Doesn't say much about them. Okay, the rat. Likely break the machine. <laughs> Dual eyes of fire can fuel greatness, but only if all except the conductor work together with the dragon. doing the rat. I'm going to try if I get it wrong. Since I've got this fuel it won't let me use again. configuration here. Let's see what happens. Light up button. Oh, it summoned an elephant. Legendary strike. Mirabelle. The wrong configuration summoned a big old demon enemy. A most intriguing place. I don't know why you decided to jump in and say that after an elephant popped up. All right, all right. That's about the normalest thing around here. All right. I forgot what the recipe said. Why are you standing in a different place now? Oh, the elephant knocked him off his perch. So what did the rat say? Everything except the conductor. Oh, it still didn't use up the thing. It only uses if you do the right recipe, apparently. Uh, 
put the rubies in. Everything except the conductor. Say dragon, where is my memory at? Dragon. All right, what are we going to get here? Oh, we broke it. That's an interesting way for it to break. Strength of the bull. You can no longer use the machine, it appears to be broken. The weird thing being the machines are all fine, it's just the handles snapped off. I got strength of bull. Just just a damage increase? That's wonder how much of a damage increase. Wonder how much of a damage increase. Well, we're done with Lord Lau's furnace. A most in Very well. In the meantime, I will try to see if I can learn anything more about this interesting machine. I can always bring us back here later. I don't think that's gonna do any good now. Don't think don't think there's any need for us to go back there again. You know what I am going to do, though? I'm going to go back to Tien's Landing now that I've got plenty of money. Let me see if there's any stuff to buy there that I passed over on my first visit. What? Loading and then loading again? Come on. Don't play with me like that. All right. Speaking yes, of loading. Yes. Speaking of loading. Certainly, certainly. Always willing to take the marvelous dragonfly for a jaunt. This still has not lit up. But we're going back to Tien's Landing. What? Yeah, sure, I'll fight. I mean, this should be an easy fight. Consume spirit. Drains health from your enemies and transfers it to you? Oh. Well, that certainly sounds good. Tien's Landing. It's been a long time since we've been there. Just looking for purchasable bulls. Oh, no. No, you're in exactly the wrong place. This is not too hard at all. Not bad at all. Alright. 
I mean, it shouldn't be. We're going back to a place from the beginning of the game. Just to see if there's anything to buy. It's a long way to go just for commerce. Okay. I'm trying to remember if any of the side areas had shops too. I know there was a guy at the beginning of the forest that had a shop. You got something to say? Uh, you seem to have something to say, but the game's not letting me focus on you. Dude, if you're not going to get up here, I'm not even going to bother trying to talk to you. Always happy to help. What do you need? What's on your mind right now? I was just thinking that we should keep at finding a way to the Imperial Palace. It's not that I don't want it to. I'd be more comfortable. Of course. Then why did you have a yellow arrow above your head? Tease. Acting like you got something important to say with your little yellow arrow. Alright, what does the map say? There's Merchant Wang and darting links. There's that other merchant somewhere. He's not on the map. Unless Chuang moved. You know what? Now do I think of it, I don't believe there are any merchants in the tea house. Seems like there should be, but I don't believe there are. Okay, that lady's gone. Patrons, patrons. I don't think there's any merchants in here. I shouldn't have come in here. I swear, if one more person complains about how long it takes to get their order, I'm going to quit. Why have you returned? I suspect there must be some reason beyond the desire to add the agony of conversing with you to my already incalculable sufferings. <laughs> You're a pompous ass. Your jibes can nearly prick the armor of my pride. They are blunted barbs forged by the sputtering flames of your lesser intellect. Farewell. Perhaps we shall speak again, if you ever tire of the braying and neighing of these barnyard animals. No, I like animals. Is the dead body still over here? Lord, man. Do you not rot? Crazy. Sailors? I'm not looking for any sailors. I'm not looking for any sailors. Shinmu too, he goes around constantly talking about how he's looking for sailors.
come on load screen I've got an economy to save with all of my purchases I'm probably not even going to end up buying anything I probably already had enough money when I left here to buy everything I wanted but we'll have a look-see we'll have a look-see Okay, none of these people will actually sell me anything. You people, you're the same old people. Beggar, merchant, chew. Yeah, that guy is the one that didn't have anything useful. Sipa sa ayer ki unyer, kwanur kshinro ni sipa. Ak we wo ofir, san kaso weer. Ono you. Nothing useful. Okay, let's go talk to the forest merchant. And then we'll go down to the acrobat and the guy that bribed me in the first place, see if they've got anything new. Well, not the guy that actually bribed me, the assistant of the guy that bribed me, since I pulled the old quadruple cross and pretty much got rid of everybody. It appears you've gathered everything you need to get the marvelous Dragonfly airborne again. I guess this mission has been a success. Let's get back um, to the camp at Tien's Landing. With the Dragonfly, we can continue on to the Imperial City and resume the search for your master. Nice scripting you got there, considering we already did all that a long time ago. Yeah, those guys don't have anything. This is the Good guy. To see you again. Supplies. Flawed, flawed. Gems, gems. Styles. Uh. Yep. Nothing useful. She help. Yeah, the minuses are... The minuses, man. I don't like those minuses. I'm not going to spend money on a boost if it's got a negative offset to it. Unless it's like a really good boost. And the offset's not so bad, but... I considered buying some of those ones that another merchant had. But those ones that that guy had just weren't any good. Not a merchant, at least not the type of merchant I'm looking for. <laughs> you return! It is because Merchant Shipeng is such a fine and wonderful and magnificent merchant. You wish to see my wares, yes? Hell yeah. Yes, yes, and yes! <laughs> my skill and suavity as a merchant triumphs once more. This fellow may have taken a few too many blows to the head. <laughs> <laughs> my charm works again! Dang it, it's all gems. And I know none of them are going to be any good. Well, looks like this was a waste of a trip. Hello again.
Focus plus seven, health minus three. Health plus seven, chi minus three. Charm and issue, I don't want to make with that. So if I bought both of these, that would give me seven focus, four health. A cost of negative three chi. Sure. Why is my focus so high? My mind isn't that high. And I guess I just got a lot of um, style, or I got a lot of techniques that raise focus, I guess. Yeah, there's one already. Yeah, I've got a lot of techniques that raise focus, okay. Which is good, because I like using that gun. But I'm done messing around. In the next video, I will have somehow magically gotten myself back to where I need to be. I'm not going to make you watch me run all the way back and fly all the way back to where I need to do some quests. So we'll pick back up probably back at the Lotus Assassin Fortress.